The madness in March has arrived as the number 16 seed in the East region, Fairleigh Dickinson, takes down the number one seed, Purdue, 63 to 58. This is the second time in tournament history where a 16 seed upset a number one seed with UMBC shocking Virginia back in 2018. The Knights were all over seven foot four player of the year, Zach Eady, every time he touched the ball, even with the average height being only six four on the court for FDU. Edie only attempted seven shots in the first half, and even though his touches increased in the second half, the Knights still forced 16 turnovers. FDU was up by five points with one minute left in the game after Sean Moore hit a long three at the top of the key over Edie. Moore led the Knights and had the best game of his season. He was everywhere on the court, finishing with a career-high 19 points and added five rebounds, two blocks, and only committed one turnover in the win. Moore scored nine out of the final 11 points for the Knights. FDU only won four total games last season and didn't even win their conference, coming in second place, but getting the automatic qualifying bid with Merrimack transitioning from Division II to Division I. As a 23 and a half point underdogs, this is the biggest upset in NCAA tournament history. And this is the first time FDU has advanced past the first round of the NCAA tournament in school history. 16 seeds are now two and 150 in the first round of the tournament. FDU is now the Cinderella team to watch as they try to keep the magic alive. And for continual coverage on the NCAA tournament and all college basketball news, keep it right here on Yahoo Sports.